You know, Joe Lieberman, very active in recent years, but doctors say even a single fall can dramatically change your life, especially if you're older. Joe Lieberman's independent streak brought him to events in New Hampshire over the years. You are the new silent majority. Drawing hundreds to this no labels convention in 2019. He helped lead the centrist third party movement after serving more than two decades as a Connecticut senator. In the contested 2000 election, he joined Al Gore on the presidential ticket, nearly becoming the first Jewish vice president. Leading up to this year's election, he's remained active in the no labels movement, but his family says he recently suffered complications after a fall. At 82, that's one of the greatest risk factors for falling is age. Dr. Richard Dupee is the chief of geriatrics at Tufts. He isn't familiar with Lieberman's treatment, but says that older adults often face complications after a fall. If you're lying in bed for a long time, pressure ulcer, skin injury, uh, developing pneumonia because you're not expanding your lungs, there's a lot of different things that can happen. The CDC says falls are the leading cause of fatal and non-fatal injuries for people over 65, and each year about 32,000 people in that age group die after falls. 75 and up, I think the, the risk is much greater. Dr. Dupee says strength and balance are among the most important factors in keeping older adults out of the hospital. Make sure you get a fall risk assessment and make sure that you intervene if, there's, if you are at fall risk and get therapy and get Tai Chi to reduce your risk for falling. Now, Joe Lieberman was from Stamford, Connecticut. His funeral will be held there on Friday. We're live in Boston tonight, John Atwater, WCBB News Center 5.